Hi, it's Andy here from uh, WaymouthFitnessCamp.co.uk. Just here on a Skype call with one of our legendary members who's been with us for a few months now, actually. Uh, her name is Kirsty. She's a young lady from Weymouth. And as I said, she's been smashing it with us for, for a, a few months now. Um, and we just wanted to get her on, on a call today so we can kind of tell you guys a little bit about sort of the program and, and how Kirsty's been getting on, the sort of results, how she's finding the nutritional side of things, the training, and all of that jazz. So, Kirsty. First, um, how long have you been with us now? Do you remember? This will be my sixth month. Six month. Crikey, cool. She's been here, been here a while, attacking it. Okay, that's all good. Um, and you know, the very first time that you sort of came to a trial week and decided to come to, to kind of working with us, was there anything like in particular that you were sort of nervous about or apprehensive about before you actually come and started with us? Um, I was really worried I would be able to keep up. And everyone else would be amazing. <laughs> I wouldn't be. Yeah. But um, it wasn't as bad as I thought I'd be. Obviously, I wasn't that fit. It ached a bit afterwards, but I soon got into the swing of things. It was fine. Cool. And do you remember in that in that very first week, like sort of that trial week? Did you did you ache like hell after the first session or two? Yeah. Um, yeah. It really hurt to like go up the stairs. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. So I always find it's it coming. Was really bad. Yeah. Coming down is always, always a bit of a bitch as well. <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> it's really bad. After, after, obviously, I mean that that initial kind of kind of first session or two, some people get a bit put off by because obviously you know they've not done that kind of training before and they've not felt that kind of you know ache and the pain in their legs before and they think, oh crap, I must have done some damage here and this can't be doing me any good. Um, obviously, you're someone who kind of ploughed through and and sort of got stuck straight into it and, and cracked on. Um, do you, do you remember how, how long it took for, you, for your aches and pains to go in that first week? Was it like a couple of days? Yeah, a couple of days after the first trial week. Yeah. And then it got easier. And yeah, and, and sort of after, after like the first couple of weeks, we, you weren't still feeling like you'd been hit by a bus or were you? No, it was no. fine after the first week. After the first week, cool. It was just the first initial week was a bit of a shock. Yeah, that, yeah that, that always kind of throws people a bit. <laughs> cool. Okay. Um, now, when you came to us initially, what was it that you were kind of looking to achieve? I, I mean, remember you had a pretty specific goal in terms of like where you wanted to be. Yeah, I wanted to be a size 10. I was always I should have been a size 14, but I never want to admit it. So I used to squeeze into 12, so I wanted to be as comfortable as size 10. Um, just feel a lot more happy how I looked. I was getting to the stage where I was getting upset about how I looked. And just wasn't happy, really. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay. And now, how are you feeling? A lot better. <laughs> You're size 8 now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, quality. Okay, wicked. I mean, Kirsty's actually shown me her, uh, her sort of pictures from when she started and, and kind of where she's at now. And yeah, you made some mega, mega improvements. Saying, hey? yeah, look, look, looking awesome. So that's that's great. And how how are you kind of feeling now as well? Are you, are you like like sort of just about on top of it, or um, how, well, how, how are you? Like, like sort of confidence wise and, and just being chuffed with yourself and that really. That I never, I just avoided wearing, and now I can. I feel like I can wear pretty much whatever. Quality, yeah. beauty. I feel a lot better. And you're you're off on holiday in a, in a couple of weeks' time as well, eh? Bikini time, yes. Yeah, can't wait. Yeah, I really so. Can't wait. Before that would terrify me getting into a bikini, but now I feel a lot better. Yeah, wicked. Top bombing. Okay, cool. Um, with regard to the the nutritional side of things, Kirsty's someone who's actually. Really nailed it, and like she'll she'll bang me a recipe every now and again, um, which I'm oh yeah, I love that. So I mean, how, how have you found the the nutritional side of things, Kirst? Yeah, I really enjoy. It. I think that's the bit that I enjoy the most is finding like new things that we can eat and just playing around with recipes and stuff. And before I could cook anything, I would burn my toast or cook the eggs, anything. And now I, you know, I cooked my mum Mother's Day dinner today. Yes. And I, I've learned more than just. Yeah, quality. And I mean, obviously, with, with the nutritional side of things, like some people think, oh, Christ, I'm going to have to give up caffeine, I'm going to have to give up alcohol, I'm going to have to um, uh, get rid of like processed foods and um, and added sugar and all that, all that sort of stuff. And, and they think, oh, crap, what the hell else is there to eat? Have, have you found it a struggle or have you found it relatively easy when you kind of get into it? Um, at first, I did think the initial, oh my God, what can I actually eat when you read through all the stuff? Yeah. It is yeah. a bit 
shock, but then you kind of know, and you, once you know what you can and can't have, you just research into certain things, and with a little bit of effort, you can find loads of really nice stuff. Magic. Cool. Magic. And how, how do you find, like, your, um, I mean, obviously we've changed your nutrition quite a bit from, obviously, when you like, sort of first come to us, but, how, I mean, how do you find, like, energy levels and, like, sort of, I think I think when you started, I think you said you felt a bit bloated and, and all that sort of stuff. I mean, now are you, are you generally feeling pretty good? Yeah, I feel a lot better. I can never lie in. I always wake up at the same time each day now, which, yes. is, <laughs> which is good. Yeah, so you're not feeling bloated. Pretty much killing it, then. <laughs> Tip <Pretty> top. <laughs> nah, that's nice, nice, massive. That's this. So look, I'll I'll, I'll let Kirsty go now. But um, as I said, just wanted to get her on the line to to give you a bit of an insight into kind of how, how she's found things with us with us on the program. Um, and so thanks very much for popping on, Kirsty. And I'm going to see you this week. So have an awesome evening, and I'll catch the rest of you guys very soon as well. Bye bye.